Welcome back everybody. My name is Altamar and we are going to be continuing our let's play of Pillars of Eternity. Where we left off last time, we were just in the city. We turned in a quest uh, to give some... What was it? Oh, my keyboard's not working for some reason. Hang on one second, I'm going to tab out and tap back in. That's better. Okay, uh, to give a potion to an expectant mother who was worried that she was going to give birth to a hollowborn and now we have arrived at the black marshes although there appears to be a significant amount of enemies here mostly trolls how may i help trolls don't like fire right that's always been a thing well actually it worked really well yes nope. i should run Where's my tank? Go fight him. There we go. No help out with that. Time to finish this fight off. Not a particularly hard fight. Trolls don't like fire, apparently. Which I am perfectly okay with. Of course. As you wish. Because that one took like 74 damage. That was pretty impressive. Let's keep quiet. Oh, there's something here. What is this? Blood moss. Excellent. We found some moss. Oh, we found some banditos. All right. Well, you fight that one. Mm -hmm. You fight that one. Hi. You're gonna cast some. We're gonna cast Dazzling Lights once everyone thing is all in to uh everyone stopped moving. And then we're gonna cast some spells. Hmm. I've not shifted this guy's spells yet. Some of them are pretty neat. Okay, anyways, let's uh Yes. Leave. I Our fire job will go back. It would appear that the L law is coming straight for our... Yes. Oh crap, that ranger is going to die. Hi. Attack of opportunities can be bad. I don't know if we can actually cure her in combat. We'll use a level 1 spell just to see. I'm curious. Lava. Nope. Alright, what do we got? Hmm. So uh, kind of we're almost dead. No, he's like mostly full life. Our poor doggy is just getting pounded on. Oh no, my mage. If he withdraws, he's gonna die. Oh no, he's okay. How may I help? What do we got left for spells? What is it? Alright, I think we're okay. That kind of sucked a little bit. Our ranger took a beating. Luckily, we have camp supplies. We can rest well, out. As you wish. And this is all going to the stash. Also, I went and sold all my stuff between videos, just because it was easier that way. So we have a bunch of money now. Yes. The better part of valor. Someone carved the initials TRS into the log. What's this? Shipment crate, that's what we're looking for. And a tattered note. And then we have a saber and a golden sewer. 
We should probably go turn in that quest. Actually, let's do that right now. If we turn in the Smith's quest, we can actually probably level up, I'm hoping. In which case, we'll get some mechanic skill, and then we can go finish the temple and come back to the Black Meadow later. Which would be super duper nice. And we can also see what they have to sell. See if we can buy some better weapons and armor for ourselves so we don't get shoved into the ground so much. Alright. Into the blacksmith. Oh, also, if you do go into the blacksmith and you try and steal stuff, I would highly recommend not doing that. They'll kill you. Good day to you. Hand over the crate. I found the shipment you're waiting on. Tuatanu reaches out to take the crate, raising it effortlessly onto the counter. His face splits in a broad smile. Why, so you have. This is excellent news. We can finally get back to work and show you real black hammer quality. None of these flimsy little swords. Here, I'll give you a taste. He ducks behind the counter and arises with a heavy wooden shield in hand. Might not have had much in the way of materials to work with, but it's still black hammer craftsmanship. You go on and take that. And here, some coin for your troubles, too. His pleased expression dims. Did you find anyone with a wagon? Bandits overtook the wagon. I doubt your people survived. Tuatanu shakes his head, running a hand over his bald pate pat. Poor fools. I always told them to hire some guards instead of palming the extra coin, he sighs. I'll have to hire on more hands. Don't suppose you want to settle in Gilded Vale, try some delivery work, he smiles thinly. You have my thanks for your assistance, friend. Give me some time to work the forge, and you'll have a pick of your next run of weapons. Good day to you. Let's take a quick look at his new stuff. There's a fine rapier. Fine saber, that's kind of sweet. Fine warhammer. So we have slightly higher quality weapons, but nothing... Ooh, what's brigandine? That's better than what we were using. So is that. But it's also really expensive for what it is. I don't know if there's anything we want to buy here. What about shields? What do they got for shields? Elworn buckler. Eight deflection, small shield. Fine medium shield is twelve deflection. Sixteen deflection on a large shield though. Hmm. I guess nothing yet. Okay. Well, he gave us a shield. Let's take a look at that. A larder door. He gave us a door. <laughs> Alright, fair enough. I guess. Now the question is, did we gain a level? We did gain a level, but did anybody else? Preferably the priest. No, he's a hundred and something away. If I were going to level you up, how many mechanic skill could I possibly get? Just three. It's not very good. Okay, I'll have to think about that. So she can be better at shooting, which is nice. Wounding shot is hobbled target. Predator sense. Damage bonus on damage over time creatures. Increased accuracy and damage in, say, modal, so it's like a active thing that we keep on all the time. Look at that one. Vicious aim sounds pretty good. And we're going to level up our main character. We can only get up to three mechanics, so that's not very good. Maybe a couple mechanics wouldn't hurt, though. Or one mechanic. Now we have some lore, some athletics. Oh, we get a new talent. Okay. Hmm. We could get some more. Untroubled Faith stuff. Or we can go ahead and get our. Weapon Focus to give us some accuracy. 
But we have a lot of people to do that, so I'm going to use... I think I'm going to take Untroubled Faith. So what does that give us now? Plus 5 Deflection, plus 10 Fortitude, plus 10 Reflex, plus 10 Will. Not bad. Apparently I'm deceptive. Actually, we all are. Slightly deceptive. Alright, well. You must we didn't gain a level like we were hoping, so let's continue on with our journey. We can still do the temple later. As you wish. When we have more mechanic skill. I wish, I really wish I had known at the beginning of the game that that was going to be a thing. I would have leveled up somebody with mechanic skill. As high as possible. But it will. We'll wait until our priest levels up, and then we'll, we should have some mechanic skill then. Hopefully. I only need a minute. A minute of what? Are you fatigued? Nobody's fatigued. Who needs a minute? What the hell is that thing? That's a wicked. It's like a white sort of. Um, How may I help? That's a lot of dudes. How may I help? Like a lot of dudes. All right. Um, How may I help? <laughs> Could roll a boulder of fire on them. I don't know if that would do anything good for us, though. I sure do well. What is it? Okay. So that was a few wicks. Apparently, wish. they give some vessel flesh, which sounds truly disturbing. And our priest still didn't level, but other people did. What do you need? Hundred? Close. So close. So, Aloth, our mage, has gained a level. Let's give him some... Actually, we can get him up to four mechanics. Which I think might be good. He doesn't really need... Lo oh, I guess he does. Next level, we'll give him some more lore. And he gets some new spells, so... No level three spells yet. But, let's see what we can get. What's Combusting Wounds do? Damage over time, and it does a radius attack. Corrosive Siphon. Steals Endurance. Merciless Gaze Necrotic Lance. Mirror Damage is actually pretty good, but we're not going to grab that. I think we want... Um, blind would be nice. Or Confusion. Confusion would be really good. Alright, we're gonna grab Bewildering Spectacle. What's Arcane Veil do? Deflection Rate. Grimoire Slam is... Large Damage and knocks Creature back. Penetrating Blast uh, negates some damage reduction. And a bonus first level spell just does what it sounds like it does. But what else can we get? Oh, we don't want that. Weapon focus. No, we don't need any of that. Gunner, no. I think we're going to go with one of the class abilities, probably. Heart of the Storm. That's so close to Heart of the Swarm. And then we could have been a Zerg. Bonus level 1 spell would be kind of nice. Or Penetrating Blast. Let's see Penetrating Blast. Or Grimoire Slam. 
Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with Grimoire Slab. That sounds pretty good. And Adar leveled up as well. Give him some athletics. A little bit more stealth. Or just two athletics. That looks pretty good. Um, we can get bonus knockdown or wary defender. What's that? Modifies defender to give us plus 10 deflection, so a bunch of defensive stuff. Hold the line, can engage another additional enemy. Or we can get some cool utility things. Uh, we'll get defensive things. We want him to be a tank. <clears throat> So we can get sword and shield. I think hold the line is also pretty good. We already hold three people at bay, so that's pretty pretty worthwhile already. I think wary defender. Let's grab that. Get a few more defensive things in play, because we need tanks more than anything. And I just tapped out back then. I shouldn't say tapped out, I windowed keyed out because I'm an idiot. Easier. All right, quick save. Of course. Now let's go. Ghosts. This overturned cart bristles with crossbow bolts. Blood stains dark in the cracked wooden slats. Shh. Anything? Nothing to see. All right, moving on then. That leads us out of the area. Another camp. And what does the flame reveal? You should see this. A fine hunting bow and some camping supplies, a potion infused with vital essence, and a golden swill. Ah, oh, there's spiders. No! Damn it, I almost got it away. Yes, you are. I need to do a... Let's try bewildering spectacle. We're gonna wait till they get sort of in combat. It's not gonna be the best one in the world. Oh cool, they're wandering around. Okay. Um... What is yeah, you fight that one. That spider just wasted another spider, or possibly my wolf. No, wasted another spider. That's cool. Confusion is always fun. Sleep would do me good. You're fine. I'll take care of it. Lay in low. Now that bow though that we got. We're gonna take a quick look at that, because I'm betting that's better than what's her face's bow. Um, Olyra's bow. We got a fine hunting bow. We're gonna give that to her. Actually, we can just probably put it right on her. So, um, let's compare it to her war bow. So it does less damage. Does it fire fast? No, but it's got more accuracy and does more damage. Technically, I'm actually gonna use it. I think the accuracy is always helpful, even if it does slightly less damage. Oh my god, more wicks. Well, all right. Go hmm. there, go there. Yes. Go there, mm -hmm. go there, go mm. there. Go. Um, mm. now you are going to Is there like a turn undead? I'm guessing these are undead. I'm here. I wish there's turn undead. How may I help? Um, grimoire. No, we have that grimoire blast thing. Let's put that right there. Oh. Indeed. Okay, so we have that going. What? Start unloading. You can go fight that one. Hi. Um, so you fight that one. Where'd my wolf end up? Oh, there it is. Of course. 
what vessel food is. It just sounds odd. Oh, we have more friends. Hey. I shall deal with this one. At least they don't have a lot of life. They just sort of evaporate. Ooh, boots. Full, uh, or sorry, full bad nose boots. Plus one to constitution. I mean, I'm not going to complain about that, that's for sure. Where'd them boots end up? Oh, I also have this locket, which I found in my inventory. I'm going to give it to him, I think. That's a reflex and healing bonus. Oops, I didn't actually mean to swap those out. Uh, this one gives max endurance bonus. Maybe I'll give that to the priest. He likes melee combat a little bit, so why not? And the boots. They are probably in here. Yes, right there. Boots of Constitution, plus one. They will go on our main character. Gives us some more endurance and some more health. Yes. The better part of valor. There's a lot of undead here, I'll give it that. There's a plant called a burned lady, that's just in poor taste. Ah, troll. The wolf shouldn't be in melee right yet. Not until the tanks are in there. Oh well. Apparently the troll likes the wolf. Actually, the wolf is surviving pretty well. Well, all things considered. Take care of it. That was where we got those supplies. What if there's anything over there we can find with secret finding? No. That was worth a shot. Another troll. Kill the troll. Easy fight. Oh, there's something on his body. What is it? We found some troll skin. Ew. Why? What would you ever possibly need troll skin for? That just sounds completely. That's a dragon body. Ah, it's a lot more than one troll. Okay, um... Yes? Let's do that. Yes. Yes? Mm -hmm. And you're gonna mark that. It's not working! How may I have <laughs> He literally just punches it with his book. That's pretty funny. Alright, um... Not sure yet. Yeah. That ranger is kicking the ass with the Twenty-five damage a hit. I kill that one. I like how this one's just kind of chilling back. Not really too concerned about the fight. And everybody on this one. It shouldn't last too long against the combined fight or combined might of my entire group. Are you almost up a level yet? Oh, good. He should level off of this kill. What is it? Or not? High time for some rest. As you wish. How can you possibly be so fatigued? It's the middle of the night. It's the middle of the night. That's probably why they're fatigued. We'll rest soon, don't worry. 
the hell's a forest lurker? Made my die soon, actually. Instead. There we go, Durance leveled up finally. Yes. That's what we were hoping for. Um, let's get some sweet yes. combat in here because we don't want this fight to drag on too long. Some sort of weird ultra there. Oh, where's my priest? He has that spell, the Armor of Faith. Let's get that up and run it. Good. And now, let's get a heal on our main line. There you go, things are going pretty good. These things are actually pretty tough to kill, though. Um, let's go up here. Ooh, my character took a pretty hefty hit. He's actually hurting pretty badly. Let's get another heal. What? And possibly another light heal. How bad? What happened to your fire thing? Lava ruby. Okay, there's only one left now. What? Heal up them again. Yes. And oh, nothing else to Holy crap, who hit him for 60 damage? Might have been the fire orb thing. Alright, I guess that's it. We're just gonna go, whoa, the wolf is dying. Disengage, wolf. Don't stand there. Don't. That wolf is dead. Um. Okay. I guess we have this. Oh, I have these yes. two. Let's use this. Okay. Yes. Yes. Indeed. It's not working. We should also probably camp after this as well. Kill them all. Hey. Try and knock him down. He what looks a lot bigger than you, but you never know. Alright. We found some awakened wood. Of course. Alright, um, let's level up and then we'll rest. So we're gonna go purely into mechanics. So five mechanics. That's pretty good. What do these do? Brilliant radiance. So holy radiance takes additional damage, condemns foes, which makes them dazed for eight seconds. That's pretty amazing. Accuracy, uh, not so much. Modifies Holy Radiance to... Gives less healing, but increases the priest's stats. Inspiring Radiance gives accuracy. Okay, those are pretty awesome. Um, Sanctifier. Oh, those are all extra damage versus things. I think I'm going to take Brilliant Radiance. Or what was that one? The Dazed one. Interdiction. Yeah. That is exactly what we're gonna take. Man, that dude is pretty ugly. But he's an excellent priest, so. Looks are not everything. It's also yes. about how much awesome you have. And he has mm. quite a bit of awesome. Hmm. What is Very it? cool. Okay, so what's this thing? Trees and shrubs have grown around these ancient bones, shredding the monument to Galloway and beneath their leaves. Take care of it. We're just gonna search the area. And the fire shows me something new. Oh, a fine sword. That's pretty good. Uh, scroll array of fire, scroll nature's mark, and some gold. Now at least we can actually see things, which is nice. Alright, now, that fine sword I think is probably better than the one we're using. 1 to 17. Oh, it's a fine wand. Oh, it's for our mage friend. What are you using? Normal wand? 
There you go, have a fine wand. There you go, Harry well. Potter. Now you have an Elder Wand. Uh, we're almost done with this area. I know we're just over 30 minutes, but I'm just going to quickly see what else we have here. We're going to go scout, or maybe I'll just do it out of video. Go scout around to find all the secret things, and then just do a compilation? I don't know. I'll figure that out. I'm not really sure what I want to do. Another dragon body. A lot of dragons have died in this marsh, and that's kind of disconcerting. Everyone's fatigued. Well, about half of our group is fatigued. But we're almost done. I don't want to rest until... We can actually just go back to town after we finish scouting around here. I think that's pretty much the entire area. So we'll hit this thing. It leads us to the Madmer Bridge. Actually, we should also grab the one over here. Because exploration is directional, so now we can get to Cade or Cadnua as well. But for now, back to Vale. We're going to go see if we can finish off the temple in the next video. So like always, if you guys have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time.